What's going on guys, welcome back to a brand new video and we're here on UFC Undisputed 3 of our Pride Middleweight Tournament Bracket. Um, we are here with the third fight of the quarterfinals, which is Chris Lieben versus Dan Henderson. I'm rooting for Henderson, whoever wins this will be going up against the dangerous Damien Mayan, arguably the, the most rested one at this whole tournament. He's not taken as much damage as many of the other fighters have. As always, I am just a commentator, I'm just watching the fight. Dan's... Got a lot more body damage than Lieben. Lieben put on a show against Bisping and beat him the fuck up. Um, so let's jump into it, man. I'm excited for this one, and I'm rooting for Dan Henderson. All right, guys. Dan Henderson, Chris Lieben. I turned the wrong way around. But anyways, here we are. Chris Lieben, Dan Henderson. They've had a change of shorts. They're ready. Dan Henderson's definitely got the punch power advantage here. And I think he's going to try and use it the best he can. I think he's also probably have the wrestling advantage in a sense. There we go. Um, but... Chris Lieben always tends to shock me and do things I didn't expect him to, like that. Uh, but I'm fully ready for Chris Lieben to get knocked out. If not, i got a feeling uh, Damien Meyer is going to choke his ass out. But regardless, I'm going to try and not be biased. I'm going to be a commentator now. Uh, Henderson gets up from the, uh, from the takedown that he, he caused. I mean, Dan Henderson won that exchange completely. He took him down, got a dominant position, got transition, then got up. That's a full, pretty good wrestling transition from Henderson there. Another good takedown attempt from Henderson, but uh, Lieben done his best to stuff it there and was successful. Uh, Lieben knows that the power is not something he wants to be a part of when it comes to fighting Henderson. Uh, he really needs to try and take Henderson to the ground, but I don't think he's going to be able to do that either. Good uppercut by Lieben there, though. Tripped him there. Is he going to go? He stomped him. Two minutes into this fight, guys. Uh, we've got eight minutes left in the first round. Followed by a five-minute second round. Ooh, series of slips and dodges by both fighters there. Good job on both of them with great head movement. Chris Lieben going for that uppercut. Ooh, he missed the spinning back fist, got caught, which then he then retaliated with. And uppercut and a takedown there, put it straight into half guard, denied that transition. Tried to posture up and it was stuffed. Ooh, he tried to move him to full guard. Ooh, good transition though by Chris Lieben there. And Dan Henderson back up where he wants to be. Oh, Dan Henderson's been caught. Dan Henderson has been caught. Chris Lieben yet again coming out strong. Don't know how he does it. And he's just catching him. He's slipping. He's moving. And it's all over for Henderson. It is all over. It's all over. He has knocked him out with a soccer kick. He knocked him out cold with a soccer kick. Normally I see the soccer kicks and then TKO. But he knocked him out stone cold. Come on, man. How are you going to do that to my boy? Look at that. The ref's like, is he okay? Is he okay? And fucking free kick. <laughs> no. <laughs> oh, man. He's... I mean, that's the first time that's happened this whole tournament. He generally doesn't know where he is. Chris Lieben will be going up against Damien Meyer in the semi final finals guys I want to know your thoughts on who you think is going to win that one is Lieben going to shock again or is Damian Meyer going to shock again these are two underdogs going up against one another I mean Chris Lieben is he alright 91% stamina 38 head health 12 body health he's okay you know so let's go over to the bracket and see what fight is next so we now know that Chris Lieben will be facing off against Damian Meyer in the semi finals and Next video is going to be Antonio Nogueira against Vitor Belfort. And whoever wins that will be fighting Chuck Liddell for a spot in the finals. So if you guys have enjoyed this one, be sure to leave a like, subscribe down below, and I will catch you in the next one. Peace.